Hello once again guys, Desolator Magic here and it's time to open yet another of the new 10 booster bundles. The last five in a row were uh, somewhere between solid and incredible. So let's hope that that pattern continues. There we go. I like the new design overall with uh, the extra box, that's that's pretty cool. Um, don't like the slant though, that, that slant in there is uh, annoying. It does make it easier to open, but I feel like they wouldn't stack as well, or they're like taller or less stable, or just something's off. We got a blue die this time, beautiful. And here are the boosters. I'm sure it's just going to be nine straight masterpieces. That would be nice. All right, let's see what Chandra has for us. Running out of space with all these cards. All right, oh, right off the bat, we've got a foil aviary mechanic. Cool. Very good looking. And animation module. All right, still not a masterpiece, but uh, we'll see. All right, next up, oh, we've got Cataclysmic Gear Hulk. It seems like the Gear Hulks are all hiding inside of the fat packs. Very strange. By the way, speaking of strange, just caught this. This is a misprint. <laughs> wow. Right, uh, right there. Wow, I only have like three misprinted foils in my entire collection. That is awesome. I mean, that, that type of, um, like, ink pattern, boy, I've never seen it. I'm sure it's common, but I've never seen it. Well, set that one aside on the special pile. And I'm going to sleeve up that Gear Hulk right away because that is one of the more expensive ones, that's for sure. Uh, I didn't look up the exact price, but we might have just paid for the whole bundle. <laughs> Who knows? I mean, I doubt it's $40, but once again, I didn't pay $40 for these. Or $42.99, I should say. Oh, we've got Camball again. Uh, not the greatest rare in the world, but uh, Black White looks pretty cool this time around. One of my favorite color combos, of course, ever since uh, the guilds. Gonna extort some stuff. Love it. And we've got Cultivator's Caravan. Cool. Everybody loves vehicles, except for, you know, serious players who want to build a good deck. <laughs> no offense to anybody using vehicles. <clears throat> oh, next up we got the Emblem for Chandra. Very nice. Totally goes in the rare pile. I don't care what symbol they print on it. And we've got Pia Nalar, Chandra's mom. Cool. All right, we're about halfway through. We're exactly halfway through. All right. I think I could open these, like, smoothly at this point. And we've got Marionette Master as the rare. I'm still waiting for another foil mythic. Or my first masterpiece. Hopefully I can pull one on camera. Lost Legacy Foil. Holy cow, does that look amazing. Wow. Really cool. Some of the foils look absolutely insane. Then we got the Fleet Wheel Cruiser, one of the better vehicles. Fantastic. Three left to go. <clears throat> Man, my allergies are driving me nuts. And we've got the much less impressive uh, non-foil version. Oh, two more shots at it, and then we're returning to booster boxes. Although these bundles have been so far above average as far as pulls. Kind of a small sample size though. Cultivator of Blades, very nice. And finally, what does Sahili have in store for us? Really? More people call in the middle of my videos? Too bad MTG comes first. And then the person will watch this video. Uh, we've got a foil hazardous conditions. Looks pretty cool, kind of subtle, but kind of orange. I like orange foils. And concealed courtyard, fantastic. So I would call that definitely a solid, solid box or bundle or fat pack or whatever. So we have got grand total. Concealed Courtyard, Foil Hazardous Conditions, Fleet Wheel Cruiser, with a really bad cut on the corner, uh, Lost Legacy, Cataclysmic Gear Hulk, Cultivator of Blades, Lost Legacy, Marionette Master, PNLR, The Emblem for Chandra, Devastating by the way, Cultivator's Caravan, Camball, 
an animation module plus a misprinted aviary mechanic. Very happy about that. Um, I would open the rest of the bundles because I'm seeing a lucky streak here, but I promised them to a customer on pre-order. So that's it for the bundles. Hope you guys enjoyed these videos, and I'll see you next video.